Yeah, hi, Dan. This is Laurie again. I want to make sure you have the number. I'm sure you have caller ID, but it's 860-974. And also, I just wanted to make it clear that um, that I understood that you're not going to let the dog loose anymore. You're going to be running with him and, and doing all that, uh, whether you work a lot of hours or not. I mean, I'm sure you, your wife can chip in. But um, so I'm going to be walking with Maggie, and I just want to make sure that your dog's going to be either in the house or on a leash or with you guys in the yard or whatever, you know, tied or on the leash where you have control. All right, give me a call if that's not the case so that um, I know that. And I'm, I hate to be the one to have to call the dog warden, but, you know, if it comes down to it, you know, you said give me a call if, if, if I have another problem. Well, you know, I, I just hope that you understand that the dog can't be loose because it's, it attacks or it at least attacks my puppy. Okay? Thanks. Good night. Hey, Dan, this is Laurie again. I'm um, just wondering if you have the dog at home right now because I was going to let Maggie outside. And I talked to Noreen, who thinks your dog is a nice doggy, and she said that they all play together at her place and they go wandering and this and that, so, you know, at night and stuff. So that means your dog goes from your house to Noreen's and my house is in between. So, I mean, she could come into my yard while I'm walking my puppy in my own yard now. So, and since they're already now, he already attacked my puppy, it means that he's made an enemy of my puppy, so he's obviously not friendly with my puppy. So can you give me a call and let me know if your dog is in the house? You know the number, thanks. It's 9 o'clock, 9.08, thanks.